How's it going guys, it's Briefverse here and welcome to the channel and in this video we'll be showing you guys how to implement table view which is editable which means you can delete and reorder it at the same time so you can just click edit and you can reorder your cell and you can delete some of them here we go and that's pretty much it, I'm just gonna start right now Xcode new project single view application I'm just gonna name it table view editable next Great. First, let's go to Mendel Storyboard here. I'm just going to add table view right in. And of course, don't forget to add constraints here. Next, let's set the data source and delegate. So, control and drag table view to view controller. Data source and do it again for delegate. Next, we are going to add prototype cell. So, just add one. And then just drag table view cell in. Change the start from custom to basic just to have the title. And let's set the identifier to movie cell. Next, we are going to add the navigation bar. So, editor embedded in navigation controller. And just double click in the middle, set the title movies. And then we're going to add the button. So, bar button item. Just drag on the right corner, set the title to edit, and next we are going to make connections. So just go to assistant editor. I'm just going to control and drag table view in and make an outlet connection. I'm just going to name it table view connect. Just move a little. I'm just going to drag the edit button here down and make an action connection. I'm just going to name it edit action and don't forget to change the type from any to UI bar button as him connect just close this set editor we're done here let's go to view controller first thing that we're gonna need is data array so I'm just gonna copy and paste it right here for now you can just pause the video and just copy the movies data array that I prepare for you guys in the description below and paste it right here all right, for now we are going to implement the protocol. So the first one is UI table view delegate and UI table view data source. And next we are going to implement functions that will satisfy these two protocols. The first one is number of row in section, which we are going to return the size of movies array. And the next one is for the cell. So cell for row at we are going to DQ from the table view. So table view dot DQ with identifier movie cell, which we set it before with index path. And we are simply going to set the title of the cell. So text label dot text will be equal to movies at this particular index. So index path dot item. And we are going to return back the cell. And next, we are going to implement the edit function here. So, uh, first, we're just going to toggle the Boolean value, which is table view dot is editing, set it to not. And we're going to negate this one, and that's it. And of course, we have to toggle the title of the button as well. So, sender dot title will be equal to asking if the table view is editing or not and if it is then we change it to done and if it's not we're going to change the title to edit and uh, that's it next we are going to create a function for reordering the cell which is called move at row here in this function, we just kind of swap the element in the movies array. So first, I'm just going to create moved object temporary will be equal to movies at this source index path dot item. Next, we're just going to remove this one from the movies array dot remove this particular index. So source index path dot item 
and then we are going to insert this object to the destination so movies dot insert this moved object temporary to our destination index path dot item very straightforward and the next function is for deleting the cell the name of the function is editing style make sure it's commit here that's it we are going to implement an if clause so if editing style is equal to delete then we are going to actually delete it first we are going to delete it from our array so movies dot remove at index path dot item and next we are going to remove it from our table view so table view dot delete rows at the whole index path here with of course animation and I believe that's it we're done so I'm just gonna run to see the result so here we go guys just click on edit and just try to reorder one of them delete here you go you have fully functional editable table view which you can delete and reorder cell at the same time and that's it guys thanks for watching and if you find this video helpful please leave a like or subscribe so you don't miss out anything and if you have any question or any suggestion you can just leave them down in the comment section below and for a bonus video here um, just in this case if you don't want your table to be deletable you want your table just to be reorderable you can just click right here and everybody just keep coding and we'll see you guys in the next one